Hey programmers, um, after we I finished that last video, uh, Util 2, I realized that I had probably, in, mo in some cases where there was an error, messed up uh, the error checking. And so we're going to change these two methods here in the Util class, and we're going to add uh, this out reference to the method. We're going to say um, uh, it was string check text or string check date. We're going to add a comma and then we're going to say out string rf. And then we set the rf to no, not y. It's going to be set to no. Okay? And that's in both of them. And then we have to go back here in the time clock program and you can do a search and find or after it'll just give you the error messages and at the bottom um, I give you the line numbers that you go and you change okay and so on every one of those check integer and check date p behind that first field that you're checking we're gonna say uh, a comma and then an out error F and um, I don't know if you know this or not but out is just one of the ways uh, you can pass methods back and forth and on the out um, it changes it for you so but anyway I hadn't checked I have not tested this yet I tested it a second ago and it was all messed up because on this error if I defaulted it to Y instead of no so it didn't give anything so we're gonna enter some special time for me we're gonna error this date and see what happens okay it doesn't like that date so we've already used the 25th so we're gonna go over here and try to use 26 and um, 26 see how that likes that all righty so it's a holiday I'm gonna still be sick that day and so then we're gonna create these records um, okay let's go back over here and look at it alrighty it got us entered in and we still got that first one from this morning and so anyway that should fix um, the problem so let's come up here and do an error on the this integer and see what happens yeah it doesn't like that good so we're gonna exit and uh, uh, one exit and that's going to be all for this week or this video anyway